Mama, my phone off. Yeah, mine too. Interesting. Mine isn't. Can you call AT and T and ask them why it's off? How was your weekend? Um, not that interesting. You and Katrina didn't have a good time, you know, hanging out. Uh, we did. We had fun. Hmm. Interesting. You know, I called her mom because I wanted her to stop by the house before she went back to basic training. And her mom told me that she won't be back home until Thanksgiving. So I guess I'm busted too. What do you mean? We lied about our whereabouts and Kyrie must have told you. But mama, I'm grown. I can do whatever I want. Oh, then leave. To be honest, Savon, I'm getting real sick and tired of taking care of your grown ass. Get the fuck out already so I can save some damn money. Leave and go where? I have nowhere to go. Sure you do. You can go live with Shay and tell that little bitch the next time I see her, I'm taking her down. WWE style. Because I know damn well you didn't steal my credit card and spent money on that little whore. Mama. I said I wasn't going to kick you out ever again. But you know what? Effective immediately, I want you out of my damn house. All because I stole your credit card? And because your sick ass decided to lay Shay's ass down in my bedroom and didn't even have the decency to replace my damn sheets. Alright, that was a mistake. But you know what? You do this, you'll never see your grandson again. Huh? <laughs> you forgot that me and your baby mama, we're co-parents. You are just a part-time babysitter. Wow, mama. Wow, Savon, you stole my credit card and left stains on my sheet. You're dirty, and I am ashamed to be your mother right now. Mama! Brian! Your phone will be off for the rest of the year. Your outside activities are non-existent. The only time you will see the light of day is when you go to school, and I will be dropping you off and picking you up. Your social life is now canceled, along with your relationship to that damn boy.